Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Colette Boyd. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. The boardroom at the SVRC is officially closed. The restaurant concept opened three years ago, offering a spot to grab lunch and also offered a culinary arts program for people with disabilities, providing them jobs and experience. Now, according to a post on its Facebook page, they thanked the community for its business, even through the pandemic. Well, check this out. Stunning video out of Detroit showing a man setting a fire to a gas station. It happened early Tuesday morning around 2 a.m. Take a look. Detroit police actually tweeting out this video. It shows the man walk into a gas station on West Seven Mile Road. He dumps out trash of garbage right onto the floor. He then exchanges some words with an off camera clerk before setting fire to the trash and running out of the building. The clerk was transported to a local hospital and was treated for first degree burns. The man in the video arrested, but his identity and motive is still unknown. The case is currently under investigation. Well, a concert that was set to take place this Friday at the Soaring Eagle Casino has been postponed. James Taylor was scheduled to take the stage this Friday at 8 p.m. However, due to a severe case of laryngitis, the singer songwriter has to postpone that performance. In a post, Taylor said that he could have pushed through, but didn't want to risk any permanent damage. The concert is now rescheduled for Saturday, August 26th. Those with tickets will be honored on the makeup date. Refunds can also be had if you are unable to attend.